Biomedical engineering is applying engineering concepts to uh, biomedical application. We're looking at you know, trying to improve people's health outcomes by applying some sort of engineering. I like electronics and its interaction with the human body. So a lot of interfacing, uh, reading, getting biological readings and all that stuff is quite interesting to me. And then using that to either control something or to regulate the systems themselves. So I find that just fascinating. So the biomedical engineering course here at Swinburne, it's, it's a combination of different subjects where we're looking at uh, both physiology, so the students actually understand how the body works. They'll also look at, we do a lot of electrical engineering, so they'll understand the electronics behind how a device works. Uh, and then one of the things we really focus on here at Swinburne is, is hands and knowledge. Once they've completed the degree, they're ready to actually go and, into a job and start working straight away. We've, uh, we've taken uh, IBL students from uh, Swinburne since probably the late 70s. Uh, we treat students as, as an important part of our workforce. They're not seen simply as students, they're seen as biomedical engineers in training. Like the other day we got one of the new anaesthetic machines in before it actually got to go into the hospital. We got to play around with it and see how it all worked and um, see how, how the modules fit together. And we wouldn't really get that opportunity to do that anywhere else. One year my dad had a heart attack in hospital um, and I thought actually I could use I could use my engineering degree to apply it to to health you know to biomedical applications and actually make a difference to you know people who are sick you know and, and make it for a better outcome for them. So it's an ever-changing field uh, medical technology has has changed very rapidly in, in, uh, in, in recent years with particularly with miniaturization and sophistication of, of equipment, uh, so it's ne there's never a dull moment basically, every day is a little bit different.